Hello guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for the consumers who is using Samsung Android smartphone of any series like A series, F series, J series, M series if you are using any series of Samsung Android smartphone and if your Samsung Android smartphone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock and if you have hard reset of your uh, handset and then after you will switch on your phone you will get a such type of display. Here you will get welcome pop up, language option, start option and emergency call option. And when after hard reset, when you will go through all the processes, let's check what happened here. Go to the more, agree. Uh, one more thing I'd like to tell, in this method your phone should be connected to the Wi-Fi network. So you can see I have already connected my phone to the Wi-Fi network. Then after you will have to go to the next option here. Now. After uh, when you will click on this next option, you will get a such type of display again. It means your phone is again locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock. But you can see here you are getting here another option that is showing uh, use my Google account instead. Simply you will have to tap on this use my Google account instead. And when you will tap on this Google account instead option, you will get a such type of display. Here you will get a uh, get a page where it will ask you to uh, feed your email ID and password or your phone number so if you have your gmail id and password then you can easily bypass this space and go to the next space and switch on your smartphone but if you don't have your gmail id and password so you can see here you're not getting any escape option on this space and this lock is uh, known as frp lock which is generated by google to secure your smartphone uh, when your phone is stolen okay so here i will tell you how you can get a, get a escape option on this page if you don't have remember your gmail id and password so watch this video till the end i will show you how you can bypass your frp lock of your samsung android smartphone of any series so firstly you will have to reach to the starting page here now you will have to make some changes by the help of make some changes you can easily bypass this frp lock okay so firstly you will have to change your language option and your language should be uh, convert from english uh, india to english us then after go to the ok then after you will have to tap on this emergency call here you will have to dial star has zero star has and when you will dial this star has zero star has a new page will appear like this you can see here now here you will get a lots of option but you will have to go to the option that will show here sensor when you will tap on this sensor option you can see here you will get some synchronizing option on your phone display here you can't do anything you can see here your touch is not working here so simply you will have to wait here for minimum five second then when your minimum five second will be done simply you will have to go to the back option here and then after you will have to go to the next option that is showing here version simply you will have to tap on this version option again you can see here your touch is not working so again here you will have to wait for minimum five second and when your five second will be done simply you will have to go to the back option here and you will have to reach to the starting pace then after you will have to tap on this start option agree to all go to the agree now here you will have to go to the agree option now after that you will have to activate your phone's talkback option and for this simply you will have to press the power button and the volume up button press hold and release now you will have to tap on this use option now again you will have to do the same press hold and release now here you will have to draw a opposite l like this now you will have to double tap on this while using the app now you will have to double tap on this use voice command open google assistant open settings when your setting option will be appear on your phone display simply you will have to turn off your talkback option and for this you will have to repeat the process press hold and release then after uh, in this setting page you will have to make some changes Firstly, you will have to go to the lock screen option. First option you will see here, uh, screen lock type. When you will tap on this, you can see here it's not working because you will get here lock uh, pop up. You can see here you're getting here lock pop up. So you will have to continue tap on this lock screen type six times, two, three, four, five, and six. Then after you will have to scroll down, you will have to go to the option that will show here face recognition. You will have to tap on this one. Now after that, you will have to continue this for six times two three four five and six okay then after then after you will have to go to the back option here now you will have to repeat the process with the fingerprint option and you will have to tap on this six time two three 
4, 5 and 6. Okay, then after you will have to go to the back option here and you will have to tap on this about lock screen. When you will tap on this about lock screen, simply you will have to tap on this open source license. Here you will have to copy this URL. You can see here you will get a URL option. You will have to copy this URL and go to the back option. Again, you will have to go to the back. Now all the things has been done in this setting option page. Now after that, simply you will have to exit this setting page and go to the starting here. Now after that, you will have to tap on this start option. Go to agree to all, go to the agree. Now here you will have to go to the agree here. Now firstly, you will have to go to the option that will show here add network and you will have to go to this setting option. Now here you will have to make some changes, but firstly you will have to reset to default setting and reset keyboard setting. And you will have to second option erase personalized prediction, erase this one. Now go to the option first. You will have to make changes here. You will have to come on this manage input language option and you will have to switch on all the languages where the English is showing English US, English UK and another English is showing here. Switch on all these then go to the back option. Now after that you will have to go to the option that will uh, showing here text shortcut. You will have to tap on this add option. Here you will have to type all FRP bypass and here you will have to paste that url and tap on this add option now after that go to the back option here and reach to the starting page now all the settings has been done simply you will have to start this option go agree to all now here you will have to uncheck two options the first one is showing here nearby device and the again another is showing here nearby device option go to the agree now after that you will have to tap on this next option Now you will have to select this don't copy option. Now my friend you can see here you are getting your escape option. It means your phone's FRP by uh, FRP lock has been completely bypassed. Now you can easily tap on this escape option to bypass this uh, Gmail ID credential. So go to the escape option. Go to the accept. So if you want to use new pin pattern and password so you can use from this page. So right now I will go with this pattern lock and use a new pattern lock here go to the next tap on this ok next skip this space you will get a pop-up that's your all setup and you will have to tap on this finish option. Select your language. Go to the next. Tap on this continue. Select your gender. Your race criteria. Next. Go to the install and finish and finish here so my friend you can see here the samsung android smartphone frp lock has been completely bypassed and you can see here uh, it's very easy so if you want to use this uh, method to uh, bypass your frp lock of your samsung android phone so you will have to watch this uh, video very carefully because the step what I, I had given you in this video is most important to bypass your frp lock of your samsung android smartphone of any series so uh, if this video helped you to bypass your frp lock so, uh, from your samsung android Android a smartphone then do the like this video and if you're uh, getting issues in this method then make us comment our team will definitely respond on your comments so thank you so much